For years now, animal control has been dealing with an overwhelming number of feral cats, wild cats in the city of Lafayette. But officials say the current method of trying to control the population just isn't working. They're looking for a new rule to put on the books. News 18's Kelly Roberts reports about the proposed trap, neuter, and return program. It's hard to tell exactly how many feral cats are inside the city limits of Lafayette, but Animal Control and the Almost Home Humane Society estimate about 25,000. There's a lot of them, more, more than them, than us. Lafayette Animal Control Officer Josh Clumpy says the number of feral cats has always been a problem, and what he is doing now is not working. Right now, if there is a stray cat problem, animal control is called. An officer traps the cat and takes it to the Almost Home Humane Society. That works for that one cat, but that doesn't work for the overbreeding and the continued of that colony. So animal control and the Humane Society are suggesting an addition to the animal control ordinance of a trap, neuter, and return program. What trap, neuter, return does is when you trap that animal, uh, spay and neuter them and return them. They are not allowed to breed. That colony stays the same size until they just simply die out from, uh, from life. It's much easier to just alter them and return them right to that place where they were living and where they had food and shelter and had really been kind of thriving in that environment. Right now, when the cat is taken to the shelter and not returned to the colony, it only encourages the colony to grow. Because when you take an unaltered male or male cat out of a colony, and say that cat gets, you know, either rehomed or euthanized. Another cat with its colony will actually move into that area. So now your colony is just growing, growing, growing. The program will also require those taking care of feral cats to register with the Humane Society as a caretaker. That way, the shelter can work with the caretaker to get the whole colony spayed or neutered. The council passed the ordinance on first reading on Monday. The second reading will take place at next month's meeting. In Lafayette, Kelly Roberts, News 18.